All right, what's up guys? It's Nella fam. Welcome back to another video. So in today's video, we're gonna be looking at Ramatra and like why exactly nobody is using him. It's kind of confusing, you know, simple for the simple fact that when Ramatra actually came out, he was really viable, he was really usable. And we're gonna go in game, we're gonna see like if he's still usable. And the reason why I say why he's like not usable is because I've seen so much like less and less of players playing him. Like I rarely see him in game. Now to be fair, I mean, we only really see Moaga in the game now. So, I mean, yeah. Think about it, I still see a lot of divas. I still see a lot of raw hogs, especially Doomfist for some reason now. Like I've been seeing a lot of Doomfist, Moaga, um, maybe Arisa and Junker Queen and Sigma still. This whole like role of characters, uh, Wrecking Ball, Winston, Actually, just Wrecking Ball, Winston, and Ramatra. Yeah, that's pretty much it. Everybody else, I see a pretty fair share of. Even Reinhardt, even though Reinhardt kind of feels really bad right now. I don't know, I feel like Reinhardt is kind of like like selective at times. Like, he's really good in certain situations, and then like, he's not an all-around... It's, it's hard to explain. He's a good tank, but for the meta right now, he doesn't really feel good. Him up against Marga, he gets absolutely destroyed. And then, you know, for the most part, him against Ramatra, he gets destroyed. There's a lot of other tanks that destroy him that has a lot more health. Like, Roadhog has a lot of health. Sigma has a lot of health. And I know he's supposed to be able to like mitigate damage and be able to like push the objective further and literally doesn't feel good Like it's it's really just that he just doesn't feel good sometimes Oh, so Ramatra like he, he used to be really 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 good And I think think the reason why he's necessarily not as good right now is just because of like I said characters like Moaga, Rohog and shit like that having such so much health and shit that it's really hard to kill people Oh my god, speaking of fucking Ren uh, Reinhardt Hey okay, boys, I'm gonna I'm try to I'm gonna try to secure a nice dub for us, okay? I'm gonna die. Dude, this is like my first game coming back in like fucking a week. Do you really want me to stop playing this game for an additional two weeks? Matches not be absolutely astronomically sweaty. Who the hell do you think you are? Now don't try to fucking disrespect me. Do you understand, soldier? I do want to know in the comment section down below. Let me know your guys' thoughts if um uh, Ramatra is a lot more useless. I'm not gonna necessarily say like he's, he's like useless or anything. I just feel like a lot of people aren't picking him as often anymore. I mean, look at that. That used to kill people so fast. Like it used to be like three hits and then we're dead. Now it seems like it's just ticks so many hits to kill somebody now even Reinhardt I mean I, I've used Reinhardt against um Ramatra and I completely destroyed Ramatra like numerous of times it feels like the only thing that's really good on Ramatra now if you guys know the um but from uh Ramatra like a little while ago it's like the only good thing on him is his alt like that's pretty much it uh, to me he just doesn't feel good I take it back, kitty. So I'm saying, like, look, I had to use my alt just to be able to, like, kill them. That's kind of my point. The only good thing is his fucking alt now. A lot of his abilities doesn't feel as, as uh, menacing anymore. A lot of his abilities doesn't feel, like, as strong as it used to. Ramatra used to be literally a force to reckon with. Well, pretty much the Moaga of, you know, like, season, like, five or season six, whenever he came out. He was literally just the Moaga of that, that little, like, time frame or whatever. As they come out with newer heroes, like, other heroes kind of get, like, a little, like, like, nerf of sorts, I guess. Look at this! Nigga, I I ain't doing damage! The fuck is this shit? Oh my god, bro. I felt like I was like tickling his fucking butthole or something. Like I literally did no damage. I'm not saying it's impossible to get a kill. For a lot of like the healers and shit like that, constantly being healed and constantly, it's just, it, he just, he feels underwhelming, okay? Feels fucking underwhelming. Like I said, I don't think he's possible to be good with because of course like no hero is necessarily possible to be good with, but a lot of the time like he just isn't as strong, I feel like as he used to be. Hey bitch, damn, what? Shit. This point we might as well just give it up. Just let them win at this fucking point. Oh, that's actually really tough. I got my art way too late. I or like, hello? Talk about bro, this game is not real. Saying I mean you guys have more art. I mean when usually when you're doing bad end game, yeah, you tend to get your art a lot more. Yeah, of course they have more art than us because you know they were fucking destroying us. The more damage you do, the more art that you, art that you charge. Oh my god, I almost forgot to mention this. Thank you guys for a thousand subs. I think we're almost at like eleven thousand, like one hundred, I think. Oh no, we're at eleven thousand and like like 60, like 160 or something like that. And that's that's amazing. I, I, I appreciate all the love and support that you guys have been showing the channel. I mean, like we are just growing so fast. Like I, I didn't I thought it was gonna take like a couple of days to get to 60 or yeah, uh, 11,160, but oh, to 11,000, I mean. I thought it was gonna take a couple of days to get to 11,000. Cause we were we were at like 10,000, like 930 something the last time I made that video. Hey Hans, are you gonna stop that? We were at like, I think 11,000, like 936, I think. Wh whatever I had said in the last video that I made, whatever I said in that one, that's like where we were at. It's crazy cause we, I think like, I gained like almost like 200 subs or something like that. So it's just thank you guys for all the support. It, it really does mean a lot. I mean, you guys have been just 
it's like really really supporting the channel viewing all the videos and all the other kind of stuff now we're on the way to 12,000 so hopefully we reach that goal hopefully we reach 20k um and shit and yeah pretty much just gonna be still dumping out videos and shit I still have a lot of video ideas that I want to do because I just like I don't know why I be at work and just like thinking of like hella like uh video ideas it's not a happy Wednesday I gotta go to work so don't say happy Wednesday it's not a happy Wednesday not for me at least I do like 12 hour shifts too so it used to be a lot worse 12 hours three days so like it, it, it was a lot worse at one point I mean technically I work more hours because I did 36 hours for I did 36 hours for three days now I do 40 hours for four days four tens and then you got uh three twelves or so. so technically I'm doing more but dude them extra two hours are fucking killer but it was at Amazon like and also Amazon sucks by the way I just want to put that out there that that company fucking sucks I hate Amazon but it's like one of those jobs like when you're poor you just you literally can't help from going to like you have to go to Amazon because it's so damn like the only job that's paying like a somewhat livable wage can I stop getting bullied by Arisa it's paying like somewhat of a livable wage so like you just say like whatever you know you go back there then you have those people that go back like every fucking like year or some shit that was me I'm, I'm those people ever since senior year when I'm, I'm 22 now so senior year I think uh, I've been there ever like damn near every I think there was one year I didn't go though I think, like I didn't work there when I was like 20 or some shit like that I don't remember I don't fucking remember but I know like there was one year I, I think that I didn't go probably but you have so many people literally go to Amazon like early pretty much like they'll leave and then they'll like just come back some people I used to see that and they're like they're like constantly coming back to Amazon like they'll leave and I think it's because like if you don't know they have like a time okay everybody damn near knows unless like they're not 18 yet and they're not in the workforce Pretty much if you're under 18 yeah uh you have like a thing where you have like a time system to where like you have like a certain amount of hours they give you like 10 hours or some shit so you can pretty much come and go as you please but don't think that's a good thing they don't be like oh now i'm gonna go to amazon no it's not a fucking good thing once you run out of time you get fired or at least once you run out of unpaid time then you get paid time and shit but if you come in a seasonal only get well you get no hours you get no hours of paid time i don't know man it's it's all right it's just an all right job like, let's see the menu meat pie is 10 bucks damn that's a lot a sausage roll yeah, I've, I've never seen this before oh and i get no refunds man this should look like ass man get these fucking corn dogs out my face see nothing about no damn meat pie a sausage roll and a, and a, a snag isn't that just a hot dog a dagwood dog bitch it's just a damn corn dog they tried to add a different name on it and add a higher price dude i'm literally stuck are you serious am i actually really stuck what wow that is Wow, trust me, I ain't locked only playing Ramatra. I will fuck some shit up. Hey, let's pick the most OP person in the game. I don't know who the fuck you think you like. Nah, man, that's it's over with at this point. Yeah, you must have not known, did you? I don't. I don't think she knew how OP Marga was. I, I don't. I don't really know how good he is against like like smaller characters. I know he's like like I said. I know he's really good against tanks, but. It seems like the smaller characters, like, maybe it's just because they'd be, like, far away and shit, so I'm not entirely sure, but sometimes it feels like they don't really do any damage. Never mind. I take it back. Nah, I'd rather not get hit by that. Were you going far? No, let's not. Let's not justice range from above. You see what I mean by how OP he is? What happened? What happened? Uh, him trapping me next to the wall actually pissed me off. Like, that genuinely made me upset. The fact that he felt like he could trap me near the wall, like, nah, hell no. Cause that, that was just like, that was pure disrespect. Like, I felt, I felt, I felt like violated that he did that. I never let anybody disrespect me like that. Bye bye. You're gonna die. Do your dog shit. Bye, buddy. I guess he thought he was gonna do something by changing the Marga. That's what I meant, bro. Counterpick. I counterpick with the same person. That's not even counterpicking at that point. I realized something, and, and, and I, I, I want to know from from you guys. Like, do you like watching uh, creators who doesn't really like talk as much? And you're dead. Oh my God. See, res me, res me. But yeah, do you guys like watching um YouTubers? Because I've seen like a lot of YouTubers who don't really do like commentary like that, and I was wondering if you guys like YouTubers who don't really do like commentary and shit, right? Yeah, no. Sit your bitch. Yeah, so do you guys like commentary channels that, or not, not, not commentary channels, like, like that just sit and like play Overwatch but don't actually like say anything? You just want to watch raw gameplay? I don't know. I guess like I get bored of stuff like that easily. That's why I do like cut commentary because I always do cut commentary like when I first started YouTube. But because I felt like it's boring to just watch somebody sit there and not talk the entire time because then if that's the case, like you could just sit there and not talk the entire time. I don't know. I, I guess I, I'm not saying that people who do that are boring. That's not what I'm saying. I'm just saying like for me personally, it's really hard to watch. That's why I don't watch live streams. Like I just can't sit through live streams. I don't know. Maybe it's TikTok brain. Ugh, I don't know. Maybe it's TikTok brain, but I've always been like that before TikTok even came out. Like that's when music, uh, TikTok was musically. So like I, I never said there and was able to like 
just watch live streams like that. Like, I've just never really been able to. Anyway, though, guys, that is going to do it for today's episode. I do hope you guys enjoyed. And, um, yeah. I'll see you guys later.